this is fiber optics uh, trainer kit by using this trainer kit you have to measure the bending loss for fiber optic cable so this kit is having some circuit block which will be inputted function generator emitter circuit detector circuit then comparator circuit as well as ac amplifier circuit so first you have to initially check the input level for the function generator so this is the digital input value the range of frequency is 1 kilohertz this is the analog input value the range of frequency is also 1 kilohertz first you have to check it the connector is fixed in this portion then you have to fix a broad positive terminal which will be connected to the cr okay so this is the positive terminal the probe is connected with the one end of the function generator point so this is the digital pulse waveform square waveform okay similarly you have to check and verify the input signal analog so the sine waveform is generated in the range of 1 kilohertz frequency so which is displayed by using cathode ray oscilloscope so the input signal is generated by using function generator either digital signal or analog signal so which is over next you have to check the light signal transmission by using optical cable first the connector is fixed in this position then which will be connected with emitter circuit so the digital input is fed to the emitter circuit this circuit is having led so the light emitting diode is used for emitting the light signal so the digital input is converted into optical signal by using this emitter led so you have to change the mode of switch in digital form okay then the cable 1 meter cable is used for propagating the optical signal from emitter circuit to detector circuit so detector circuit is used for detecting the optical signal which will be converted into corresponding digital signal okay so this is the output of the detector circuit the input is optical the output is digital signal so which will be fed to the ac amplifier circuit okay so the output of the ac amplifier you can easily verify it by using this connector so the connector is fit to the output portion of the ac amplifier circuit so which is directly connected with the positive terminal of the probe of cathode ray oscilloscope then negative terminal of the probe is connected with the zero potential of ac amplifier circuit this is the ground potential so it will be fixed so this is the connection so you can easily view the output signal which input is given digital input so we can easily retrieve or receive the input signal is square wave form next uh, we have to verify the pending loss for the optical cable or fiber cable so this is the fiber optic cable so the length is uh, 1 meter so it is a lengthy cable suppose you have to use a short cable also so lengthy cable is uh, very very comfortable for uh, uh, pending 
pending as well as to verify the losses also. So we know that easily checking the optical signal by using this cable. Okay. So the from the function generator the AC input signal is transferred to the emitter circuit. The emitter circuit is converted the AC in terms of uh, light signal. Okay. So the light signal is indicated by using this red light. So please see this red light indication which is for light signal transmission. Then this cable is bended by using this uh, rod slightly bended three or four tens or enough okay then which is fed to this this terminal So you can see the output of the digital pulse after pending the cable. See the result. So the amplitude is reduced in some level. So you can uh, see this output level. So the digital pulse amplitude is slightly reducing by pending the optical cable. Okay. So this is the pending losses. So the same signal is received but the amplitude is slightly reducing. So due to this tens of the pending of the fiber optics cable. Thank you. See this fiber optic cable. So you have to adjust this cable. Suppose you have to bend this cable. The amplitude of the, the digital pulse is slightly reduced. Please see this. Okay, so this is the variation of digital pulses. You have to tight and bending this cable means the amplitude of the digital pulse is reduced. So this is the bending loss or attenuation loss for the input signal. Either digital pulse or analog pulse. Okay. See this variation.